Hey, it's Anastasia's Hump Day Happenings, and we're wrapping it up with February and Children's Dental Health Month, National Dental Health Month. I had a parent ask me this question, which was brilliant. And she asked Anastasia, what age should kids start flossing? And also, when they're in that transition phase where they've got some teeth or missing other, you know, others are coming in and interrupting, do you still floss? What do you do with that space? Because you don't want to get the child out of the habit. Great question. Actually, usually by the age of two is when we start to floss your child's teeth. And the only way to tell, because everybody's out of a different eruption pattern, is looking into their mouth, and when the teeth touch, place some floss in between there. If the floss goes easily between there, they're making contact. So it's a great time to start remove the biofilm or the plaque in between. Now there's three things you need to know, because floss, just the string, I don't think it's gonna cut it for you. I would recommend gum chucks, G-U-M chucks. It looks just like num chucks. It's kind of like a toy for kids. Your kids will grow into this, it is so, fun, but it's also easy for parents to floss their child's teeth. So gum chucks, you gotta check that out. Second thing, air floss, it's made by Philips. Air floss is water and air, and it's just this little puff, it's like poof, goes right in between there. It makes it fun for the kids, and this way they're not looking at trying to wrap the, you know, your fingers around the string to get to remove any food or plaque. So I mean, this makes it kind of fun for them. Again, that's air floss. Finally, water pick flosser makes one for kids. And this too is great. It's just a pulsation of water that comes out, removes the food, it flushes underneath the gum, removes the plaque. And you know what? It's all about staying healthy and you're already getting your child's teeth, you know, brushing. So thank you and I applaud you for asking about getting in between the teeth. So it's gum chucks, air flosser, and water pick for kids. So I hope this helps you out. I look forward to hearing the progress with that. And until next Wednesday, take what you learn, make a difference with it.